little bit behind, catching up, quick video, House of the Rising Sun, number 52, the sound in the E family coming after the B, the sound of the B before we have the sound of the E, says 5E B2, 5 minus 2 equals 3, House of the Rising Sun, Venus 3, Earth, Venus as the second planet, and B in the letter, B to the left, and B to the right, and B down below, 6 plus 2 equals 8, B, 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 and B, Venus 8, Venus 16, Venus is in the center heart, 16, 1 and 6 is 7, 16 equals 17, Venus, Venus is also number 27, also known as again the letter B, the greatest diameter on the cross, the greatest diameter from above to below equaling to 9. This is 2. 1 is in the center, but look at the white. I only want to look at the white. There are 7 missing numbers, and 1 is in between these 2. The area diameter between the two sides. Hold on a second. What is that I hear in the radio? I hear it outside. A terrible thunderstorm is coming. They just announced on the radio by robotic messaging on the radio. I mean, I just the first time I put on the radio, robotic messaging. A, watch out. They're all talking about danger, danger, danger. Call this number. Danger, danger, danger. Call this number. If you hear this in the air, please don't be aware. The message, just like in the 70s. Now today, again, I see outside. They're showing for schools in September now, just in case there's a fire. Instead of showing the day, they make it look like it's the night. They got a, a shape like this. You can barely see the picture from a distance. Looks like the wolf. And they got a white object in the back. Right? Looks like the moon. So now they're telling us about, about the thunderstorms. So breaking and entering, 5 and 2, 5 times 2, 5 plus 2 is J and G, Jack God. 16, 10 equals to 16. 1 and 6 is 7. 7, 0, 7. When the French speak, they put 10 and 7 together. They put 10 and 8 together. They put 10 and 9 together. If they are feeling the zero position of 10, therefore, every time you come to 10, 7, 8, and 9, let us not no longer, for this situation, include, include, as 67 equals to 13, we're no longer going to include this. We're going to go 10. We're going to go 10 and 7 equals to 17. 0 will now fill in the spot for 7. Okay? 17 now. 1 to 7 on the left side of the keyboard. When we go to 18, 6 and 8 equals to 14. That is 27. 7 times 2, 7 plus 2. 7 times 2 is 14. 0 equals 6. 0 equals 7. 6 and 7. 6 and 7 is 13. 27 and 17 is 44. 8 and 9. The high sky comes under the house of the rising sun, Venus. If you ever look at the six dice, the six dice has one in the center right over here. You see that? It can either be this way, four, five, and six, or this way. Here, two and eight link. How do they link? I'm going to show you how we're going to make them link. I'm going to make them link right over here. See what I did over here? You see the way these, we cut it off, we cut it off, we cut it off, we cut off. This piece here and this piece here are separate. This comes in between. This is another system. This system is the corner, and this system is the corner. Two tails to a fish. The real world is here, and the real world is here. But the two fish are on the corners. They shifted this side of the world to this side. It's an offsetting circle. You usually see a circle like this, right? But the circle is not like that. The circle is more like this. When this circle turns around... When this circle turns around, okay, this circle becomes like this. This circle comes over here. So this circle that's already over here, 
Now they join in the same circle. Same thing they do here. So they move the sleeve into the open space in the sky, right over here. And then they join them. This joins to here, the bar in the center. And the bar in the center, that's included in this. You see where the half is? It's half on this bar over here. See this bar here? And this bar here? And this bar here? And this bar here? And the teeth, they wedge together. In here is the star. See the star system in here? See the star? If we actually wanted to go out, we can actually build the star. Here's the star. Do you see the star? And the tic-tac-toe and the mug and david that come out from it. 101, 1, 2, 3, 101. 1, 1, 1, 101. When you calculate 1, 2, 3, 101, from here to here is 9. I automatically must multiply because of the turnaround from this shift. This is my own area space. This is my eye. My area space is here. This is going to always be my area space. No matter what, I'll always take up here and behind. This is my open view. 40. 9 is the total. Don't count the area space in the center. Put the flag on that. Let's say we're going to put the flag on that, right? This would be the flagpole right here, right? Right over here. This is what it links, but the pole is electrical. It's alive. Okay, so we change it a little red. And we put a crown on it, right? Or the island's walking. The island's spread out and walking. I don't know if it really looks like anything. Here's the multi-level building. Rubik's Cube, three color, two color, three color, two color, three color, two color, three color. Multi-level, just to look at it. The six cube, it looks like this. It's one. See, here's the six. Well, on this side, it's one and eight. But remember... It's three to the left, it's three to the right, it's one above and it's one below. If I turn it this way, there's a bridge. I'm bridging both sides of one. If one owns the top, then the rule on the bottom, seven, eight, nine, is what one lands on or what one is as the core. Here's the core. The size of the core is right here. This is your core, this is your cube, this is everything. Everything has to get added onto that. And that's what makes the slide inside this design over here. What is that design? It's the corner between two sides. I bubble it on this side. I bubble it on this side, right? And then I run it. See the seven corners, 7D, seven, seven Fort Christ? Well, what happens if I run it this way? Or what happens? You see that? They're all the R letter, and this is the antenna communication. Right, and these would be the rivers, right? And then we'd have two suns crackling up on each side. One side we'd get to see, the other side we wouldn't get to see. The different colors we get is because they mix. They mix and you cannot hide it from the matter that floats in the air. The colors of the sun, they mix. Colors mix, doesn't matter where you go, so they have to put a sky hat on. So they put a sky hat on and it turns with this color. This is the color of your night sky. You can't forget what happens during the day when the sun is out, but it's a funnel system. It funnels into our world. It funnels and it divides. Two sides, always two sides, always two funnels. And then you can see this funnels in one more time. This could be a walkway or at the same time Funneling out. Funneling out, funneling in. One funnel to another funnel. All the funnels running into the same area. And all the funnels running into the same area all the time. And then over here, the walkway. Here's the walkway. This is what we're going to do with the walkway. Okay. 
the walkway. Because in the walkway, it goes down and there's a bell and it rings in the walkway. The bell inside the walkway and it goes down and it goes down into the dungeon below, below the water, below the oceans, below everything that's happening up here. So what you see over here is what passes for the rest of the green world. The green world that surrounds us. The algae, the outside air, the algae that purifies everything, the green vines that drink, that drink everything up. We call them plants, but it's the green life that cleanses everything to its own purity and then blossoms in every other color, including white. And the dream time comes in, and we say thank you to... You hear that thunder outside? Thunder. It's beautiful outside. And this is the Sky Man. Two eyes, two arms, a divided body, two legs, two arms, a divided body. What color are his eyes? Are his eyes going to be blue, purple? Do we have to see them? Or we should just put his eyes yellow, right? Is that what we're going to do with his eyes? And that's what he looks like at the end. The plant we're fed in from above. We have two eyes to see. We're an open river in life. What's this over here? This over here, has you ever seen the tusks? Have you ever seen a tusk of a boar? Have you ever seen a tusk of a boar? Have you ever seen a tusk of a boar? Well, here's the tusk, right? And at the same time, have you ever seen the horns of a cow? The horns of a cow and the tusk, the horns of a cow and the tusk, right? Separated by this magical line right here in between. Let me call that the line of heavy connect. This is the ocean of salt and brine, and here are the lakes on this side. Here's the lakes on this side. The lakes. We connect. We take the spirit vine from above, from one side only, from one side only, and we pass it through the river. We pass this through the river. And at the same time, we must understand we connect two worlds together. Only one side is needed to connect both worlds from the heavenly sun. Only one side is need to be known before we understand, before the next sun comes in. And that one comes in through this marking here, through the eyeball. Comes out through the other eyeball. Okay? Comes out through the other eyeball. And then this is, I'm trying to figure out exactly how to, how to do this together over here. But well, what I'm trying to do is piece together the house of this sun, the red sun, how the red sun electrifies everything. I might lose power, so I'm going to end this video very quickly. And then we take this. You see the way that blue line goes in there? Well, now it crisscrosses to the other side. Have you ever heard of Pharaoh and tea, how to purify tea and stuff? Well, when you're purifying, you got to send things back and forth and remix. So this is your electric going through. This is your S spirit, or this is your S spirit crisscrossing. This is your cube, two sides of a river. You need a river. One is the river, and one is the ocean. A river and an ocean, lakes, rivers, and oceans. And you come up with two sides. You come up with two sides at the end. Whoop, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to do this one. And I wanted to continue on with this one here. Sort of feel like I'm being rushed because it's raining outside. And now you can see there's two suns. And this is usually what they would say bison. The reason for the bison is showing you how much space one head needs 
in order to put the reality that I just shaped for you over here. Earth, you can say what you want, but not me. You can grab a bull by the horns, but when you're grabbing a bull by the horns, the ring is in the nose, not in the horns. The ring is in the nose. You grab the nose, you got the horns because you take advantage of that bull. To know, to be, to know, to not, to be on edge knowledge. For one to hear, four corners, 360 of one to hear. One hears of eight. See this one? That one's six with three missing spots, but this one is one. Eight and one is nine, three and six is nine, but one times eight, one plus eight. That's number 17. One creates 17, the queen. So should that dot actually be there, like being on a pole, standing on the pole, the antenna, listening to everything, picking up every vibration? Is that what it is? Is that what the core is, picking up a vibration? Or is it creation and delivering from within a vibration? Is it one versus eight or is it six with three? This equals half. This is one eighth of the pie. This is a quarter split in half. When you split a quarter in half, you get 12.5. And I want to ask you a question. I want to ask you a question. 12.5. Is that a calculation? No. The quarter is 25 cents. B and E breaking and entering. 2 times 5, 2 plus 5 equals 17. When you play poker, it's a green one. When you play heads up in poker, when you play heads up in poker, you get a green one each, right? You each put in 25 heads up, it's 50. The house takes 10%. It's $5. When the hand ends, the payout is 45 the guy put in 25, the money left over is 20 to 5. You have 4 times 5. You have his side of the spirit of the sun. 20 becomes 26. You have his Venus Saturn. You have 136. You have the light. You have touchdown. You have picked up the spirit. You have picked up the chips because you got number 1. The total bet was 50. 9 times 45 equals to 45. Plus 5 equals to 50. Plus 9 equals to 54. And that's the number right over here, 5 and 4, the number of the sun. I think I'm going to throw this out. We looked at this. We looked at the dice. Here's the 5 dice. How do we mention this? This is 101. This one is 0, 1, 0. This one is 101. If this was binary code, right, the reality of any movement is this. Do you see this? This here, this here is a singular strand going up and down. When you're going 101, you're going up and advancing. You're bending a flat area center, squaring it out, and you're moving on. This is not my art, but this is the way it works. If this one and this one go on top of each other, then this hole and this hole will be further apart. You see the angle shape over here? This is no longer 45, 45, 45. This is, um, if I can just guess properly, this might be 22 and a half degrees more. This might be 6, 7, and 5, the winning of the Kentucky Belmont Derbies. 6, 7, and 5. 6, 7, and 5 equals 5, 6, and 7. 6, 6, 6, 18. The gateway of E. Here's your E's. I even, made a, I even wrote a letter inside of this, but it's not finished yet. But anyways, up and down, up and down and over, up, down and over, up, down and over. In between this point and this point, this should be the, the this is what they call four here and over here. Is that four? When we show you the dice cube over here, okay, and it's on the telephone, it goes one, five, nine. How do I strike it out here? You strike it out squarely like everything is done. It's all about, you see this circle over here? Well, that circle is inside of this square. So there's a left over that circle because there's something to have that circle. Okay, in order to have that circle, I need something around it. And that something around it has to be something that turns into a circle. So they cut out the area. The area they cut out, if you take a look at it, when you do two of them, okay, the area in between becomes the I letter. When you connect the two together, you now have I this way, right? The smaller I, but over here you've now created H. You can have the small H, but this is not the 11. 11 is where the arm in between the H touches. 11 is half an H. Why do I say that? Why? Because the two dots met halfway. Here's your H, but these met halfway. 
I'm in, I can't use this as 11. But if I come and meet halfway here, wouldn't this be 11? Because 1 is in between. What is the difference of each one? Each one is a house of its own. What is this reality over here? Anyways, for now, this is what I would call too small of an area to design. I'm supposed to be designing it where this is the whole area. Just to explain that when you don't go on these lines, the scenarios and the realities can and are the same. But when, I, when we want everybody to have the same vision, well, he's saying now he's offline. You see, now I'm offline. The difference between offline and online. Off and on. Off and on. OFF, 1566666 is off. 1227 is off. Off is 27. And on is 29. Yellow is 29. And red is 27, equaling to orange. If it's on and off, equaling to orange, then orange is caution. It's partly on. But we're way off. The total is 56, the equivalent of two moons. If you need an equivalent of more than 28, you're automatically working with two moons. The planet that has two moons is Mars, so we're not working alone. Raphael, 7286, in the house of the rising sun, because B and E, breaking and entering, is 83, equaling to the church. 16 and 67, 17. 17, 18, and 19, like I began to say, and I want to finish just for, you know, for me and you, is that we can now go 0, 6, 0, 5, and 0, 4, equaling to 66, 65, and 64. I can relate this into a game. I can relate this into a game, and I can relate this into a game. In a game, this one is 2 to 1. In a game, this is yo, 11, craps, and whatever you get paid out, this is a 30 to 1 shot. These are all very special when 6 shows up with them. Okay. 10, 11, and 12, equaling to 33, and showing up on the 5 key on the telephone. So when we take this into recollection, this becomes 0, this becomes 2, and this becomes 3. This becomes 0, 2, 3. So if you want to know what number of creation is, this is the heart line of it. This one becomes 7, this one becomes 7, this one remains... Whoop, what happened to that? 6 and 6 is 12, 1 and 2 is 3. I reverse them. This is 3, this is 2, and this is 1. Sorry about that. I made a mistake. I made a mistake. This is 3, this is 2, this is 1. 1 and 4 is 5, 5 and 2 is 7, 6 and 3 is 9. 9 and 7 is 16, 16 and 5 is 21. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 equals to the cube. Another thing I wanted to mention about this is, now what about 0, 1, 0, 2, 0, 3? Well, 1, 0, 1, 0, 2, 0, 3 will become 61, 62, 63, which equal to 7, 8, and 9 again. So then everything fits in. 10 with 7, 8, 9 is either 4, 5, 6, or it's 17, 18, 19. So if we start at 7 and end at 7, we're going to start at 7, and we're going to end at 16. And that works perfectly. G, P, general practitioner. So that's what are my numbers show. Now, if you want to ask me what I mean, is that every time I get a zero, I mark six. Every time I say six, one always comes with six. So when you see six and one, that's real. That doesn't move. Five and two is not the same thing. On a cube, five and two reflex. Five and two reflex on a cube. Here's five, there's two. They reflect each other's corner. Um, so remember, white is very strong. There's four white missing here. Let's count. There's, there's eight missing here. There's uh, six missing here. Fourteen. There's three missing here. Seventeen. There's five missing here. Twenty-two. So there's twenty-two around. Three, nine, four, five. Fourteen is all the way around. There's four sides. Totals to fourteen. Okay, there's 22 missing. 22 and 14 equals 36. Let's turn it to another side. How about this side here? Here's 3 missing. Here's 4 missing. 3 and 4 is 7. 7 and 8 is 15. 15 and 7 is 22. No, that's again 22. Let's do it this way. Here we got 6. Here we got 4 is 10. Here we got 5 is 15. Here we got 7 is 22. So it's always 22 and 14, 36. 
36 one way, 14 and 22, 14. 1 and 4 is 5. 22, 2 and 2 is 4, equals to the vibration of the radiance of the sun. The other way that we do it, up, 1 is up, 8 is missing. 2 is down, 7 is missing. 7 and 8 is 15. Let's do it again. This one is up. No, let's not do it that way. This is up. 3 is missing. And 8 is missing. 3 times 8 is 24. The number to the church, the day of man, the bad cat. We see 6, we see 1. 8 is missing and 7 is missing. 8 by 7 is 56. Two reflective moons. Plus 15 equals 7 and 1. 7 and 1 is the queen. What's missing? Just 6. The dice don't lie. It's the story I tell and the story we work out together for a better understanding, not just for you, but for me too. Because whatever I said doesn't mean I'm 100% right, but on course to make it work between us for a better understanding for the results means odds. Thank you for watching.